gross margin equals revenue minus COGS, which is hardware, software costs to support that device. Labor. Uh, Right. Uh, labor, yep, uh, divided by revenue. Okay, so let me do let me do the maths. So if you're going to charge one hundred and sixty dollars for a computer or per user, right, and your cost is fifty dollars uh, for that, you're going to be sixty eight percent gross profit. Mm -hmm. I know I did a quick math. I don't have it on the screen and everything, but think of it that way. Um, and when you're building your cost out, and what you really want to do, and we we're not going to go too far into this, but you've got your hard cost, right? You've got your antivirus, your RMM, uh, your threat lockers of the world. You got, you know, your backups of the world. All, all the good stuff there um, that it calls for that computer. That's your hard cost. Your soft cost, you want to calculate on your direct labor. And the direct labor is your service manager, uh, your service coordinators, your level one, two, three engineers. That is your direct labor, not your management. So if you have sales team, marketing team, uh, if you if you're not spending 51, this is a great Crabtree thing. If you're not spending 51 percent of your time to direct labor, you need to be in management labor. Um, and that comes out of your out of your net um, from that standpoint. So just I know I'm throwing that out really quick, but just something for you guys to think about. Yeah, what Bo has here on, um, you know, what he you have it right. So, for example, if you do have 70 percent gross margin, you can use 50 percent for overhead because um, I've even argued that, uh, you know, and again, I'm talking to like people like Paul Sissel and Jeff Farr and, you know, Greg Crabtree and stuff. You know, like with us, I have always shot for a higher gross margin so that I can reinvest in more of sales and marketing, right? Because so if I do 50%, that eats into my marketing budget. So I would rather be 70% and then have the extra cash to put into hiring salespeople into doing more marketing and use that to fuel my growth, which has worked out really well for us. So, but it is, it is, it is harder because when you start getting up into that kind of certain gross margin, your, your fees are going to go up and there's going to, you're going to be on the higher end of, of fees, right? So um, you also can't deliver, if you're going to be on the higher end of fees, you also have to be able to deliver that kind of service. So yes, so that, that was absolutely correct.